Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to today's video. What I'm currently doing is cooking some food up before I go to the gym. So what I've got here is some frozen barbecue chicken. What I, like the barbecue I put on is just some standard sticky barbecue from Tesco's. Gonna have some bacon with it. I think this is about 140 grams of chicken. I'm gonna have four slices of bacon and then I'm gonna put it in a panini because I am currently tracking everything I eat because I'm about four, no, three weeks out from a competition. I'm not really turning up to like go max effort, just stuff like that. I'm just showing my face to get a qualifying total for the British because I really want to compete in that competition. So let's get this stuff cooking. So right, we're gonna let this chicken cook up for a little bit before I chuck the bacon on. Chuck that in there. Before I put the bacon on because the chicken's gonna take a little longer than the bacon. Not much longer because the chicken I put on is freezer chicken so you put it in the oven you, know, you put it on the pan in about I give it about six or seven minutes and it's pretty much cooked uh, so in about five or six minutes I'll chuck the bacon on I'll warm the panini up and then I should have a pretty naughty meal before I head off to the gym right so got the bacon on the go now chicken in the corner bacon over here it's all starting to come together Right, so here we're going, open it up, we've got some chicken, a bit of bacon, looking absolutely beautiful. Pat that down, there we're going. So that is what I'm going to have to eat, uh, scoff that up, go get some shorts on and then get ready to hit some squats and bench. Hopefully by now when I go check my phone, Coach D aka Duffy has sent us the bench because in the program he'd only written down the squat by accident he forgot to put in the bench press so hopefully he sent us all that and then uh, I'll head off to the gym so I will catch you in there peace yo what's up guys sorry about not posting in about a week but I haven't had any footage what has been worth watching and I wouldn't put you through that I don't just upload for uploading sake sometimes I think if the quality isn't good enough, I'll just not upload because there's no point. So what I was doing on the squats, what we've been doing for the past, I believe, week to two weeks is doing a lot more volume. So we've done a, we've done about four sets of six with 130. Then I've done three, no, two sets of three with 150. And then I'll work up to two heavier singles. So this day I've done two singles with 165 and what I'm liking about what uh, how I'm doing this is because of all the reps before the heavy set I'm already very fatigued before I get under the bar so in my head I've got to focus a lot more on my form which makes us end up have a better squat because I've got to control it because if I don't control it while I'm not fatigued I'll just straight up get buried by the bar so the set I'm on about is coming up here, I've done two sets of it, 165, so uh, that's what I mean, just having to focus a lot more on the squat, feeling like it's giving us a much better, smoother squat. As you'll watch it, I'm controlled on the way down, I dip into the hole and then bounce straight back out. By the way, when I was doing this, my legs were already mad sore, so I'm really happy with that squat, thought it was pretty good. And then after that, we've done some volume on the bench, and then eight sets of one with 90 kilo. What are you seeing here? I'll only show you the one set because it gets repetitive, but I hope you've enjoyed the content, and I will catch up with you tomorrow. Right, back from the gym. Had a sick session. Uh, legs are absolutely on fire. What I'm doing now is watching. Uh, comes up, zoom in on that. Love Island, it's absolutely amazing. So let me know what you are a massive fan of for watching on TV in the comments and uh, I'll catch up with you tomorrow. Peace.
What is going on my fellow YouTube viewers? Welcome to the second day of the video. What I'm currently doing is cooking up some food before I go slay some deadlifts. What I've got is some chicken and I'm going to put that in the same panini as yesterday. I've got some naughty chili and garlic sauce. I think I've got about 50 gram on. Uh, it says it's a, if it focuses, go on, how are you? Right, let us get this because I'm not having it. Right, focus, focus, oh, there, have we got it? Have we got it? Right, there we go, well done camera, three out of four for spice. But, sadly, that is incorrect. It's probably on the same level as a medium Nando's, maybe a little bit less. So I would give it probably one out of four, maybe not even that. It's not really that spicy, but it's very nice. Very nice. Let's get cooking. By the way, if anyone was wondering where they can try this, it was, I believe, two pound at Tesco's for the litre bottle, so give it a try and let us know what you think. Stars, I thought I'd amp it up with a little bit of chilli flakes. Not many, because it'll blow me brains out, but just a slight bit of chilli flakes on there to give it that little kick that it's supposed to. Right, here we go, so there we're going inside. And then, because there was that much chicken, I've had to put some on the side as well. And that is going to be my meal before I go to the gym. So I will catch you in there. Right, got a parcel. No what's in there, but uh, I just thought I'd open it up while you're all watching. Open that. Big box. Get the knife. There's that. There we go. I'll show you what it looks like. Right. So inside we'll have a load of bubble wrap. And first thing we have in here is glutamine. And I believe this is, if you can see the flavor, watermelon. So watermelon glutamine, that's what the first thing we've got is, move that out of the way, I ordered two tubs because I don't like using the bags, they're just a bit annoying so I thought I'd buy two of these just for convenience, that looks a little dinted, but uh, moving on, next thing, some syrup because I love myself some pancakes, but due to the fact I'm doing this cut, because I've got a competition coming up. I can't have any syrup on, so that is a pain in the arse. So I thought I'd just get some, it's pretty much like for per 100 grams, it's like four calories or something like that. So it's pretty legit. One sec, let's just take this tripod off because it'll be making noise and it's not any use. And last of all, I have a massive bag of I don't know how you say it, but it's strawberry. This is the bit I don't get. Stevia or stevia. I'm not sure how it's said. 
whey protein. So I'll show you what I got. Right, so inside I got a some protein, glutamine, syrup in two tubs to put the powder in and that is the package so I hope you have enjoyed this video if you have leave a like comment and subscribe and I will see you in the next one peace